But this is a river red gum tree. Out of the river red gum tree, you get the lerps off it. You can eat the lerps, but also it's got two different sorts of grubs. There's one in the tree and here, so if you want to know if this river red gum tree had grubs in it in the ground, you'll come along and you look for this little thing here. Right, that's a grub shell. Okay, and sometimes you will see that grub shell coming out of a hole like this. Right, so there is a hole just here. See? In there you see the shell sticking out. Then if you see the hole when you knock the dirt off and you see the hole, a spider will dig in the ground too to know if it's a grub hole. You will see this brown stuff, see that there? And a spider haven't got that, see? It's not brown. If it was a spider hole, that would be white. It's a spider lining it over with web. Okay, so that's the grub from out of the ground, that. Then over in the tree itself, you walk around and you look for stuff like this. See this here? Right? This is a grub what lives in the tree, and if you're not sure about the grub living in the tree, you just get a piece of grass or a bit of stick, and you get that, and you poke it right there with a little black dot. You see a little black dot? Poke it in there, and see how far the stick going in? You watch. That's telling you the grub in the tree. T to know if it's a good sized grub, the bark is nice and smooth here, no cracks in it. And then if you want to know if the grub is big, you look for the bump around here and the grain on the bark go up. But if you see little brown cracks going across the tree like that and a big bump, that means there's a big grub in there to be about this fat, okay? This sword, I see this little brown stuff, not a lot of the stuff, that's the one that's in the tree. So you find a sword that's on the ground like that. And you know that one there, then it's from the tree grub. And you find the hole, and this one is from here. So this one would come out of here, us barking, we call this one Bharti, which would look like egg, and we call egg, which is white, we call egg Bharti. The one in the tree we call it Bichula, because it's white, but it's got little pink marks across it. So that's Bichula in the tree. This scrub here, it eats the root of the tree, like this one up here, it eats the tree to survive, so they both feeding off the river red gum tree. Right, to get the grub out of the tree, that's a little hook, can you see that little hook? Right in the grub, then you cut the bark away and you just get that there, poke it up in there and hook the grub out with that little hook, right? If it's in the ground, the grub in the ground is about this deep, okay? About this deep, so then you come up and you get the root of the tree, right? You get the root of the tree, pull it up, see how that there long now? Then you cut that there and join it on there and the hook's there now, see? And that's to go down in the ground and pull the grub out with this root, see, and that joined on. Grub, when you get it out of the ground or in the tree, you can eat it raw if you want to, but it's nice to cook.